The meeting between President Muhammadu Buhari, service chiefs and other members of the National Security Committee held at the President's conference room. After the over three-hour closed-door meeting, Defense Minister Mansoud Dan Ali came to address the press. Responding to questions, he blamed the Heather's farmers' clash on encroachment on grazing route and the anti-grazing law which has provoked the Heather's communities. If those routes are blocked, what happened? These people are Nigerians. It's just like you going to block passage or uh, river, uh, this, uh, what do you call it, shoreline. Does that make sense to you? These are the remote, but the immediate cause, what is it, if I may ask you, is a grazing law. These people are Nigerians. We must live to live together with, with each, each of us to learn how to live together with each other. The minister spoke on steps taken by Nigeria to purchase Super Tukamo aircraft from the U.S. and moves to get a commission to tackle issues of small arms and light weapons. We also discussed the issue of this purchase of uh, Super Tukano aircrafts that the American government uh, agreed to sell to our country. The terms and conditions were discussed. So also we agreed that the conditions are a bit stringent, but I, Minister of Defense with the uh, Foreign Affairs Minister and American Ambassador will sit down and reduce some of those conditions. In another development, President Muhammadu Buhari met with a sixth governor committee led by the chairman of the Nigerian Governors Forum, Governor Abdulaziz Yari. They came to see the president over the controversial non-remittance to the federation account by the NNPC. I'm not saying that we're being shortchanged as a governors or as a state, but the entire federation is being shortchanged by those activities. One, one of the last one of the NNPC, they said since 2010, there were no payment of joint venture cash call when the oil was 110, up to where the president took over in 2015. So what they are doing now, why the account of the federal account is always uh, being low, because they are paying dual, paying the existing, at the same time paying the arrears. They were confident that the issue would be resolved by the president. From the position of Defense Minister Ali Dan Maso on the encroachment on the grazing route as well as the enactment of the Anti-Grazing Act, one would not be wrong to conclude that from certain quarters in government, many are viewing the Headers Farmers Clash as one that originates largely from the part of the farming communities. From the Asurok Presidential Villa, Amikaro Atta, ITV News, Abuja.